Hey, good morning. How are you? This is Pastor Jerry with another slice of toast from the bread of life. How are you today? Wow, I've just been out there transplanting plants and, and moving things along. I, I got some grapes. And I want, how many like seedless grapes? I love seedless grapes. And so I, I bought some and, I, and it said uh, spread their roots out. And I opened up the package and I, I looked at the roots running up on the stem. And I thought, man, how do I spread these roots? How do I get it to root? And, and, and then I looked at Ephesians chapter 3, verse 16 through 19, and I realized that God says the same thing. Paul speaking, he said, I, I, I pray that out of his glorious riches, he may strengthen you with power through his spirit in your inner being, so that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith. And I pray that you being rooted and established in love may have power together with all the Lord's holy people to grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ. And to know his, this love that surpasses knowledge that you may be filled in the measure of all fullness of God. And I think about those roots as they spread out, how, how important it is that they, they get a hold in the dirt, that you, you're carefully to spread them and, and they look a little weak. I gotta be honest there, they don't look so good sometimes. And some of them don't have the little hairs on them and you wonder, how will that ever grow? How will it ever take root? But you know, as you immerse it into the soil and you put a little water, it, it starts to take root and it takes a hold and, and great things start to happen. And I look at that and I say it to myself, well, God has the same plan. He wants us just to begin. The Bible says never despise small beginnings. And he wants to take it and what little bit of, uh, of root that we have and he wants to cause it to produce and to grow and to get deeper in him. He waters us with the word, and pours his spirit into us to give us strength. Listen, you, it's time that we get rooted. We need to be rooted in Christ. We, we are so spread out and taken over by other things. We, our roots are on top of the ground and all over the place. And really he wants them to be immersed in him. A lot of things take place in life, but God in our life is the only thing that really matters. It's in Him that we get our strength. It's in Him that we'll last forever. What are you rooted in today? Some are rooted into sports. Some are into their jobs, their careers. Some are into their friends. But my friend, I ask you today, who are you rooted in? Jesus wants you to be rooted that you'll bear fruit, much fruit, fruit that will endure. Hey, God bless you. This is Pastor Jerry. Till we meet again.